Hello, Austin. Hey, Vinny. Welcome to the Human Resource Machine. All right, I've gone through some uh, training videos. Yeah. I've, I've gone through the compliance uh, worksheet. Well, as Is you that did, everything I need to... No, to, as you are fully aware then, it never ends. Right, yeah. We're going to go through I, some more tutorials. This is, um, this is a game that's made by folks uh, who've made uh, Little Inferno. I like some Little of the folks Inferno have worked on uh, World of Goo. Mm -hmm. uh, I really like this game. It's, a, it's $10, it's on Steam, but you'll see as we go into it, this is a game that seems like it was really designed for tablets and, okay. uh, and touch. We're playing on Windows right We're now. We're playing on, uh, this is the Steam version. You can okay. buy it directly from them um, for 10 bucks as well. Their DRM free version. Ooh, you know, ooh. That, that's not, well, we're gonna start that a doesn't new... Sound like a very, that doesn't sound like a, thing a human resources machine would be okay <laughs> with. Lots of DRM. Uh, we'll start a new game. Uh, it's a puzzle game. Okay. Uh, and, uh, let's go with this young lady. Yeah, she seems nice. She's, she seems like an yeah. eager go-getter. Um, and I'm, the reason I'm starting from the beginning is, is you will see what this game is. Uh, you do not want to watch me flail, flail around okay. in later levels. I, I just want to say, this: I've gotten a bunch of jobs in my life. I've yeah. never gotten an employee badge as quickly as you've gotten the job. Here's yeah. your badge. I've also never gotten an employee, an employee badge with a full body <laughs> no, shot. That's true. But whatever. <laughs> This is a weird office. Okay, it's good to know. I'm fine with that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn the music up even more here because uh, I really enjoy their atmosphere and sound effects. I like there was a mail room and a busy mail room. <laughs> oh brother, this, this office gets crazy. I'm excited. Okay, let's jump in here. Year one. Years go by very oh, quickly. Oh boy. Okay, <clears throat> so what this game is, and again, I really enjoy this game. Okay. Uh, and it was unexpected because I wasn't quite sure. Every, people had tried to describe it to me and I did, wasn't quite getting it, so hopefully those watching this quick look will uh, come with us to learn what this is. Okay. Uh, so basically it's a math game. It's a math and programming game. Okay. Uh, we've got to put things from this inbox to the outbox. Okay. And uh, this is the very early game, so we, we program our, our worker by saying take something from the inbox uh -huh. and then put it in the outbox. Cool. And we need to do this three times because there are three things in the inbox. Oh, okay. Right? I see. So this we'll, is... we'll run our program. Yep. And she'll get to work. She's a good worker. This is a pretty like uh, things like this keep coming out. Uh, things with like light light programming elements. Yeah. I started playing Else Dot Heartbreak, which okay. has some of that in it. Uh, I know I know that next game by Brendan Chung, uh, Quadrilateral. Quadrilateral Cowboy is going to have some of that stuff. I'm happy with it. It's cool. It's very cool. That was it, easy. Though. I think it's it's a good like conceptual introduction. Yeah. Like don't walk away thinking like you know how to program. Yo man. And I think if you already program, you might have a leg up because the concepts will be right, there. Right. Right. Uh, but you'll see that it gets complicated. It gets busy mailroom, yo. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't stop. Uh, so. Oh boy. Well, this is still very early on. They're still going to teach us new concept, concepts, and we're still going to get new. Um, bits of code we can use. Mm -hmm. uh, so now we can just run a program. And just uh, jump it. And basically jump back to the yeah. beginning. Yep. Uh, and I'll speed this up so she just kind of takes care nice. of all this. Efficient worker. Yeah, very efficient. No lunch break. Getting those uh, promotions. Every year, moving up. Three years on the job. This week she's mopping floors, next week at the fries. There you go. Uh, I don't know what that reference is because so I don't, I, I don't, I can't listen or watch okay. or, or ingest media while I'm at work. That's all, true. I'm all committed to the job. All right. Uh, so now he wants us. I haven't even been reading this because I've known this. Ignore the inbox for uh -huh. now and just send the following three letters to the outbox. Uh, B, Whoa, oh. U, and G. Okay. So I'm going to copy from square okay. four, put it in the outbox. You're not kidding. This is definitely. <laughs> I'm going to copy from this variable, let's say, uh -huh. uh, put it in the outbox, and uh, I'm gonna copy that one. You're uh, copying? You're not like, okay, I I'm curious what this copy, looks like. I'm not taking it. So it's gonna stay there? Yes. Weird, okay. Um, and that's the end of my program. Yeah. Gub, got it. Mm -hmm. I did it. I see what you mean that's a tablet. It looks like it would be good on a tablet device, because like, even just clicking those buttons Yeah, it's really a lot of touching nice. and dragging and uh, Not that this doesn't work. No, there's only one part, and we'll show you a little later, where I really think it makes me kind of angry that you mm -hmm. can't use a keyboard. Uh, grab the first two things from the inbox, drop them into the outbox in reverse order. So I've got to go to the inbox, 
I've got a copy to this space. Uh -huh. I'm gonna go to the inbox again, and then I'm going to just drop that in the outbox. And then you can grab. And then I can copy from. Yep. And then uh, this thing, and then drop that back in the outbox. Uh, I apologize now while things are kind of light, when you see me brain fart later, okay. and it's gonna be like, what are you doing? It's so obvious. Uh, I've made it pretty far. Okay. Uh-oh, what'd you uh, do? Oh, sorry, there's more stuff. Yeah, uh, you did a jump? Yeah, I need to do the run this program again. Uh, I just, I'm, I'm doing this quick, like, and I, I know it's a lame excuse, but I'm not gonna be thinking through all this stuff okay. as it happens. All right, so uh, basically he said there's not enough stuff in there because I have to get this whole thing Yeah, out of it. yeah. And that's what happens when you fail um, a thing. So you can actually step back through your program. Oh, nice. And, and see, see where it went happened. wrong. Yeah. Cool. And it doesn't call it out though. You have to go through your lines of code to be like, where did this break? So sometimes they'll say not enough stuff in the outbox, which is what sometimes they'll it's say like, an like error message? it's the error. Yeah, it's like, that's hey, actually great. This is the wrong output. Because uh, eventually right. you'll have stuff that's like, this. we were looking for a different thing. And sometimes it'll specifically say, we were looking for this, you yeah. gave me this. So I've done some, like, some, I haven't done program. Uh, I've done some light programming in things like uh, Twine and in, there's a kind of a visual novel uh, uh, programming thing called, uh, what is that thing called? RenPy? Yeah. Uh, and like that feeling of like, oh, why did this come out the way? Uh, what did I, uh, oh, there it is. And fixing it is actually like an amazing feeling. Uh, sure. And so I'm, I'm really interested in seeing them gamify. Like not gamify, gamify is the wrong word in this. No, case, no, it's but. the right word, I think, because you'll see in a second, they actually will give you like, how many steps did you take to complete Ooh, this? Okay. And like, here's what we think the okay. par is. Uh, so they'll they'll get you on how many lines of code did you make, mm -hmm. and then also say how many steps. Did how you take efficient you. is your code? Yes, okay. and, they, and they explicitly say in the um, scoring there that like, hey, these things might you might not be able to get these together. Right. Like you'll be able to get right. one or two of the or, or um, that's one listen, without the other. That's the truth. But figuring uh, that stuff out is really rewarding. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, and I think that's why this game is fun. Uh, so. There is this like, there are these weird cutscenes and you can see how far this goes mm -hmm. up. Uh, so I made it up to, I'll show you where I got here at But home. you're close to the end. Yeah. And, and by, is it just impossible? I just, I'm telling you, I just hit this like, I can't think about this. Uh, really, and it was late at night and I was like, yeah. oh, I'll, I'll try again. Uh, and, and on this computer, uh, I'll load up the save later. I'm um, somewhere, I think, around here. So I like Little Inferno, another game by the studio, a whole bunch, and that ends really spectacularly. So mm. I'm really excited to hear. There's how weird this... stuff happening. Yeah. The other cool thing is your employee gets older. That's really it. cool. Yeah, yeah. That's really right. cool. Uh, these all people all have interesting <laughs> things to say uh, that I'm just kind of blown through here. You can get that dialogue again. You can tell me more about the um, assignment. Okay. Early on, there's not a lot to talk about because right. it's pretty easy. Uh, and you can get an example, which actually helps out sometimes. Oh, really? Okay, of so what this they're is, looking so for. So for each two things in the inbox, add them together and put the result to the outbox. I mean, yeah. So, sure. right. So they're yeah. just saying. Boom. So that can be helpful. So I'm going to go to the inbox. I'm going to copy, copy. to uh, square zero here. I'm going to go back to the inbox. I'm gonna add that to uh, this thing. I'm gonna drop the sum in the outbox, and then we're gonna start it all over again. So I do, oh man, so this is where I'm starting to be like, I wish this had, I'm already right now feeling like I wish there were keyboard controls for all of this. I wanna be able to hit, I wanna be able to hit buttons on my keyboard to, <laughs> to quickly do this, do this cause that's like, um, or have a tablet where I can just touch. Uh, so you can head over to the left here, and these are harder, okay. but optional. Okay. And these branch off. Uh, I did all of these, and I was able to do all of these, and I'm an idiot, uh, up until, uh, does it say here? It, it's somewhere around, there was a, uh, here. The Fibonacci? I, I stopped here. Okay. And I said, I'm not dealing with the Fibonacci sequence right now. That's, that ain't me. Right. You like need, right now. You need a vacation to go take <laughs> like, care of that. that maybe I'll be, come back. Right. Uh, that's the hard, the hardest day of the crossword puzzle. <laughs> that's, really. like, I, I, I I will do. I will look at that, but just not right now, mm -hmm. uh, because by that point I was already mentally exhausted from some of the other. Sure. Stuff. All right. Uh, so send all things that are not zero to the outbox, and luckily we have a jump if not. Zero. Oh, cool. So we can go grab it from the outbox, or inbox, put it in the outbox, unless it's a zero, in which case we're going to jump back to the top and do this again. That's nice. Seems okay. To make sense to me. Yep. Right? I'll slow it down so you can see it. She's zero, nah, zero. Peace, peace. Yeah, and you can kind of see it running through the code here. Again, this is all super early on. They're right. not even grading me yet. 
Well, well I they guess are. now they okay. are. Okay, yeah. he did, he did yeah. just say at the beginning of this, he was like, now you're going to be evaluated. Oh, sorry. So, okay, yeah. So, yeah. I nailed okay, it. wait, wait. So, steps is per walking steps? Uh, no, this is how many... Uh, oh, how many steps on the right yeah. it is, but they loop, it counts them, it runs through them each time. Yes. When it jumps, it's still executing those steps. Yes. Okay. Sorry, yes. So, the, I did it in four commands. Right, but, but it wants steps, not commands. It's uh, judging on... Oh, no, it's using both. It's commands and also steps. Yeah, I think I it's see. the commands. Uh, so I've got, you know, this inbox and it's a jump command. Right, and that's, so that's the size challenge, but then the speed challenge... Then the speed is that's how many... Yes, that's cumulative. Gotcha. Yes. Okay. So then I boned it on that one. Right. So, so it, this can be, be more efficient. So there must be a way... Hmm. Okay. And I can go back and I can Do be you, like, well, hmm, what, what would make this more efficient? I obviously need to, like, dump something here. I don't want to think about that right now. I do, but no, let's yes, move on. Yes, we need to move oh. on. But right, so like somewhere in here, there's an extra jump happening, or right, right, right. now there's I'm something. kind of thinking about it while I'm trying to stall not to move on to the next one. Uh, uh, let's I, move on. Oh, no, is that still, oh, maybe it. Uh, inbox, if it's zero. No, you don't want that. You don't want to jump before the outbox. Doesn't she end up just grabbing? If I, if I put this up here. Uh-huh, and then, then the jump after. That might. Yeah, that might work. run it real quick. Because then, because then she isn't I think doing. Run a little faster. Yep. Boom. Look, more efficient. Look more at efficient. That. Perfect. And that that's super fun. Yeah. Uh, All right, so you get the little dots if you've done both yeah. things. Cool. All right. Now I think we want to put everything that is zero. Uh, the zero advocacy community. Yeah. <laughs> that's, uh, committee. The text is really cute. Uh, I'm kind of clicking through it because I want to get a little to deeper the, the in. Tough stuff. Yeah. Uh, send only the zeros. All right. So. This is usually where I start off, and then I get confused. Inbox. <laughs> you want to grab something. Go to the inbox. Usually, you want to go to the inbox. Right. 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 I'm going to copy the thing from the inbox. Well, I just want a zero. So if it's a zero, we're going to jump down here, and we're just going to drop it in the outbox, right? Yes. Uh, Otherwise. So let me just send only the zeros to the inbox. So jump mm -hmm. zero, it goes to the outbox. Obviously. Uh, or we just go back here, right? Yeah. That's it. Seems like it. Nope. Oh, sorry. I need to, and I need to run this program again. Oh, if didn't it, it, it's, if it's a zero. Okay. I think you grabbed that one and dragged it over. Oh, no. Okay. Good. Yeah. Nice. Probably something inefficient here. Sure. Slash and burn coding, man. Yeah. We're just going. We got we got other things to work on today. All right. We nailed that. All right. Some, there's something inefficient in there. But that's okay. We'll move on for now. Hey, just mark it in my progress report. It's gonna like stick year. in my head all day though. Well, I'm gonna wake up at 2 a.m. tonight. We're gonna to blow past that. Something okay. else will be stuck okay. in your head. All right. So now we're gonna add and subtract. Um, cool. All right. For each two things in the inbox, first subtract the first from the second and put the result in the outbox. So we're gonna to go to the inbox. We're going to copy it to uh, mm -hmm. zero. Zero. Here. Yeah. Subtract the first from the second. So we're gonna go back to the inbox. Uh. Let me no. Just, does it, does it matter? Well, I'm going to be holding the, th the second thing in my hand, and then I'm going to go and say subtract I see. the first thing from the second. So gotcha. I'm going to be holding it, and I'm going to that's, say... I didn't know that's how the subtract yeah. command was working. Okay. So then I'm going to say subtract that. I see. Subtract the, the contents result. of a tile on the floor from whatever value you're, you're currently holding. I okay. see. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yep. But then, and, and put the result in the outbox, but then subtract the second from the first. So actually, I'm going to need to go grab uh, that to make For sure it's there. Each two things. First subtract. Okay, I see. I'm going to get that. I'm going to put that result in the outbox. Then I'm going to go copy from this one. Yep. And then I'm going to subtract from the second one. That one, and then stick that in the outbox. And, and then I'm, jump it. And then run this whole program again. Yes. All right. Let's try that it. was really. Let's see what happens. I can imagine someone watching at home right now going like, "What the hell is he talking so about?" So hopefully this works. They subtract. It gets a three. She puts it in there, and then she grabs uh, that one. And subtracts subtracts that, it from that one. Negative three, and then we run this whole program again. Yep. All right. Let's speed it up. Yay! Nice work. Ding ding. Let's see how we did. All Look right. I think I nailed it. Yeah. All right. Oh no, the equalization room. I would say- That sounds terrifying. If, I, if you ever send me to the equalization room, I'm done. Like, I'm not coming out of that room. I'm gonna say if you like this so far, you should probably just stop and, and be surprised. Because yeah, we yeah, might yeah. solve some of these puzzles. Uh, I think that's about the um, uh, processes you get. You get one more. I don't think this is it. 
uh, you get a couple more things that are going. One is that you can increment numbers. Okay. So it's called bump up and bump down. Okay. And you get labels. And that's what I've seen so far. And I've had that for a while now. So I'm yeah. not sure if you get more later on. Um, oh, here are the labels. Mm -hmm. So here, the only thing, this is where the game, my one criticism of this game, I think it's great so far, is uh, you have to write this stuff with your mouse. Oh, you can't. You can't type it with a keyboard. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Source machine window. Whoa. Oh, good. Good. Oh, I've turned on You've the. You've turned uh, on voiceover, or whatever yeah. it's called. On yeah. Hold on. Exiting narrator. Thank no, you. No, it's still. Is it still? I, I think it turned it okay. off. Okay. Sorry. Let me get back in here. And uh, what did I? <laughs> what did I hit to do that? I don't know. I hit some keys. Maybe F. Yeah, there you go. That makes sense. Anyway, you can't. Can't type. Right. That's a bummer. I, it, you know, it's obviously it made is. for touch screens. Yeah. Uh, because like you know, it's hard for me to type uh, to write. The counter in here, right? Right. Like, uh, that looks good. It just, it just makes me not want to use the labels. Yeah. Uh, anyway. And you, are they useful if you were well, later on? Them? They do. Yeah, okay. they are. Uh, all right. So get two things from the inbox. If they are equal, put one of them in the outbox. Disregard non-equal pairs of people. This is where you have to start using your brain. Right. Oh, this is where. Yes. Before this. No. Before this is just follow the instructions. I see. Okay, Here's so. where you have to start solving stuff. Get two things from the inbox. So if get from thing one, uh -huh. let's copy it to uh, space zero. Yep, and then same get thing. Get thing here, and now. You don't need to, you could, oh yeah. That's I'm right. gonna subtract it. Wait, wait, wait. Get two things from the inbox. I just wanna read this out loud yes. so people can follow okay. along with their thoughts Sorry, at yeah. home, because we're moving fast. Get two things from the inbox. Uh -huh. If they are equal, uh -huh. put one of them in the outbox. Discard, discard non-equal pairs. Yes. Okay, So repeat. There's no like, is this equal? So the way, not. To, the way to see if it's equal is if you subtract them and they equal zero. Correct. Uh, so we subtract them. We grab thing one, copy it here. We grab thing two. Subtract, subtract it from the, the yeah. Uh, and if it's zero, then we will drop uh, it in the inbox. It doesn't matter which one because they're both the same. But we now have, a, we're holding a zero in our hands. We always hold the difference or the sum in our hands. Right. So we do have to copy from. Um, from the one on the ground is fine. Yeah. Yep. And that's fine. If it's not, we're gonna discard it and we're gonna jump back here. And also when we're all done, we're gonna jump back here. Okay. okay? Yep. Let's see how this works. So we grab it. And then we grab it. And then hey, that's equal. the same. She Boom, grabs, grabs it, a seven, drops it, yeah. it down. Uh, Those next two is gonna, should be the same thing. It should run through fine. Two yeah. throws away that two, grabs that bit. two. It's a two, toss yeah. it in. Well, these are different things. That's not good. Yep. Ooh. We did it. I, I'm gonna say it's probably pretty efficient. Yeah. Oh, we Wait, got one okay. extra step in there. What is it? I don't know. Oh, Vinny. I don't know. Ah. I know. I know. <sighs> Go. So the other thing Any is, so I, I should show you this too. Um, I'm gonna pass this. Oh, only okay. big numbers. So you can, Tell me about you can it. do um, three tabs of code. Oh. You can copy and paste them in there to run variants of your code. That way you can uh, be like, okay, well, let me try it this way. And I believe you can also copy and paste this code into like a text thing and send it to people. Oh, really? That, I think so. I forget where I read that. Uh, so like if you if you hit copy after you dropped a bunch of things in, that, that just copies it. Like that, to like a clipboard, okay, and then I'd be able to paste it in okay. later. I, I, and there isn't you 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 cannot type to do any of this stuff. You're no, ninety nine percent sure. I mean, when I hit the keyboard, things Sorry, went bad. So like, obviously there are shortcuts. Right, there are shortcuts. I hit cookies. F and it went to full right, screen. Right, right, or not full screen. All right, grab two things from the inbox. So we'll grab that. We're gonna copy that to here, uh, and put only the bigger of the two in here. So this is a fun one. This is another like yeah. solve this math yep. thing with limited functions, yeah. right? So we're gonna copy that to there, and then we're gonna grab thing two. The bigger of the two things uh, in the box, yep. And then okay. we're going to, um, I'm just gonna oh, copy. Oh, there's also a new jump that you have. It's an if negative, if yeah. If negative, oh, I sorry. see, I see. I'm gonna put this here. Uh, and then uh, what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to subtract. Mm -hmm. I actually don't know if I need this. Yes, I do. I'm going to subtract. Because you need to grab it if it's yeah. bigger. Uh, right. so I'm going to subtract. The, I'm now holding thing two in my hand. Yes. I'm going to subtract that from thing one. Right. And then if, if, it's, if it's negative, that means thing uh, thing one is smaller. It right. wants the bigger, right? So yes. if it's negative, uh, I'm going to copy from here and then put that in the outbox. No, 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 wait, wait, is that true? 
Because yeah. if it's if you the second thing is the one you're subtracting from the first thing, right? I'm holding the second thing. Right. It's a two. It's a two. I go and I subtract it from a nine that's in zero. Right. Oh, I subtract nine from it. Oh, you subtract again. Yeah, I guess yeah, it's confused. Yeah. I'm trying. I, I, just, I look at it as what's on top of the other thing. She's that's holding the thing on top of her call. hands. Okay. She right. does it vertically. Right. Vinny and I have our hands in the air. Yeah. We're like doing hand yeah. motions. It's a whole thing. <laughs> like I am not a. I'm a. Uh, this sounds maybe like a cop out, but like I am a not a math person. No, you're... I am like a, a creative like. Yes. Hey, you show me two numbers, I'll tell you why they don't need two and two equals five. Like I'll come up with a story. <laughs> right, right. That's like I can do that. Two and two is five is a very nice thing. Dostoevsky <laughs> said, yeah. obviously. Like here, I'll tell you a little story of why yeah. two and two can equal five. Let me tell you about this wizard named Bellator <laughs> yeah. and a ritual he did. So, uh, but that being said, like I love math. Uh, it just is not doesn't come totally. as naturally to me. Does this make it? Does this make these sorts of math problems? It's not math problems. They are programming problems. But is this compelling, like in and of itself? Absolutely, is because you, you wind up doing stuff, and uh, let me just move past yeah, go, this. Yeah, let's do this one. Uh, you wind up having to solve these things that you usually just have functions for, like mm -hmm. multiplication and like right. equaling, and lot more logic puzzles. Yeah. But you do wind up getting into these math puzzles that are like, if I just had an e does not equal, this would be real right. easy, but yeah. you don't. Yeah. Uh, okay. So uh, we need the or greater than, right? Mm -hmm. uh, so it's almost like programming in basic. Right. Um, okay, so we, what we're doing, we're grabbing the bigger one, which is uh, this, and we put that in the app box, but if it's not, then we're going to copy from uh, here and mm -hmm. put that in the app box. Yeah. Uh, and then we're gonna jump this back. Well, what happens if it's equal? Uh, does it say? Begin the command, jump something in the negative. If they're equal, zero. just pick either one. Okay, you're good. Uh, okay. Yeah. And then uh, we'll jump this back to the beginning. Well, let's just run this. Okay. Okay, it was bigger. So yeah. We got our negative six. We got our negative nine. Negative six should be bigger. Yeah. So, okay. Nice. That's the same. It doesn't matter. Yeah, you're good. Great. Let's good see work. how we did. Do you ever hit a point where you are? Ooh. Close. Close. I've got an extra step somewhere in there. Yeah. Do you ever have you ever done a thing here where it's something about the like greater than type stuff? So two things I'm thinking of. One is if I was doing this for real, there would be moments where I'm like, okay, this is the solution for this type for greater than, and I would actually copy, I would want that copied somewhere. Or like maybe I just memorize that sequence. I haven't done it. Uh, you can go back and look at other, you can Your roll previous back. solutions. Yeah. Okay, so the other thing is, I like that there are different tabs because there's definitely a thing I could see myself doing in a game like this eventually, where it's like, that's not good. Yeah. Uh, where where it's like, okay, I'm gonna use this tab to figure out this one little bit of this thing. Sure. And then like I'll go over to this tab and figure out this other bigger meta thing or this other structural problem, and then I can like bring this code into here, or I know to re redo it here. Do you know what I mean? Have yeah, you found yourself doing oh, that sort of stuff? Where it's like, uh, I haven't used the copy and paste that much. Okay. Uh, or the multiple been, tabs even to just try out really different things? Not okay. that much, but I'm definitely at the point where that's probably what I should be doing. Okay. All right. So I think we just want positive numbers. Send each thing from the inbox to the outbox, <laughs> but if a number is negative first, remove its negative sign. All right, here's some more math. Yeah. All right, so we go here. Uh, we're gonna grab something from the uh, inbox. Yep. Uh, if it is uh, negative, and we're gonna just put it in the outbox because that's what we need to do. Mm -hmm. But if it's negative, now we got a runner function. Right. We. Well, uh, and then actually, we can just uh, we can jump back here and run that whole thing all day until we get a negative. Right. Because you then, only. Well. You, right. Okay. So now we got a negative, uh, and we're gonna have to copy that thing to space to zero. zero. Uh, and then we're gonna have to. You ready? So, yeah. Go ahead. We're gonna have to subtract right. it from itself twice. twice. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, okay. I got it. I yeah. got it. I'm on board. So we're gonna subtract it from itself. We're gonna subtract it from itself. That should make it a positive. Yes. Uh, and then we're gonna jump it back to the beginning here, uh, and we're gonna put make sure that's in the and outbox. everything goes to outbox. Yeah. If it's that should be it. That should be it. Yeah. Again, this is pretty basic. Yeah, yeah, but, but you do have to remember that it's doing this. Yes, <laughs> that's like, totally. Yeah, and that was one of those things that like took me twice to do. Of like, well, is it adding? Oh no, it's subtracting, yeah. and then it's adding. Yeah. Right? Did you change the positive, negative to positive? You add it. Yeah. Right. Like that whole thing. Uh, yeah, you're good. You got this. I like that it, the way it's phrased there too. Just like remove the negative sign. <laughs> right. Uh, that also, for me, that's not just. Oh, we're pretty close. 
We had the next, maybe an extra jump or something in there. I love that it's removed the negative sign because not only is that good as a puzzle thing where it's just like, uh, like makes you have to figure out how do I do that? What's that look like? It also is a really good just like thing from a bureaucratic boss. We're just like, yeah, just remove all the, no the negative signs. <laughs> yeah, let's just do that. Yeah, we gotta be positive. We have to, the numbers have to be positive. Just remove the negative signs. Like you don't, you don't understand. My, you don't understand at all. You right. have no idea what my job is, do you? Yeah, no. How long should that take you? Yeah, yeah. Uh, a half hour. Cool. A year. Uh, yeah, apparently. Actually, a year. Let me see if I can. Uh. uh so I think I'm gonna bump out and let me see where I'm at on my other save because I don't want to yeah. show everything. Sounds good. Uh, we'll get past this other little cutscene. Just take it's a good vacation. Going to the beach. Yeah, it's good. Great. We've got a very like Joe versus the volcano vibe. Mm -hmm. Sabbatical beach paradise. Good. Uh, I will say the other thing about this game is it just moves. Yeah. Like. All right. So this is uh, the save I started in the yeah, office. There was no little... cloud save. Yeah. Oh well, wow. yeah. you also yeah. yeah. Eighteen right. years at that company. Twenty-seven years at that company. With this guy, he's ready to get out. Buddy, uh, my guy at home. Like I said, can we my... can we see that Fibonacci thing that you didn't want to do real quick? Sure. I just want to see it. Sure. Fibonacci visitor. Uh oh. Advanced employees only, Vinny. Yeah. Okay. All right. For each thing in the inbox, send to the outbox the full Fibonacci sequence up to but not exceeding that value. Good. Uh huh. No. And like you can get this stuff. Right. Sometimes they'll even be like, hey, listen, go to an outside source, come back. Right. Go do some research. Yeah. Ooh, phew. Okay. Yeah, like I hit this and I was like, these are the things. Sure, I could sit down and spend a, a, a day do, or whatever amount of time yeah. it's going to take me to do this. Just not right now. I bet you'd be able to leave it feeling a lot more comfortable with what the Fibonacci sequence is, though. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, absolutely. But and and also, um, also but it was one of those things I want to see the story. Right. So I'm like, right. I want to keep moving. You'd also know what Sean Murray talked about when he says that his game is just maths. No Man's Sky is just it's just maths. It's just. It's maths. just so we were recursive uh, algorithm. It's just we left off here. Fractals. And I'm, I'm gonna jump here, and again, I am up to here. At home. At home, up up to okay. here. That's not too far away from here. Yeah. All right. Let's see what this was. I, uh, um, okay. So here are some of the other things. Those are letters. Man. Yeah. So here are some of the other things we get uh, in here. So we can. There's bump. This will increment something up or down, a number, up or down. What about a letter? No. So you can't go from A to B? No. Okay. Um, but now I can, this is a little, I'm sorry if I'm going to explain this um, not correctly, but hear me out. Mm -hmm. We just got this. You can copy from the square uh -huh. and I'll pick up an eight. Cool. Okay. Or I can copy Have you not been, oh. from the value of the square and that'll pick up square eight. Okay? No. So, all right. So this is, this is the contents of the square, uh, of the, I'll no, pick I up you. that okay. block. Yes, Or yes. I will pick up what this square is telling me. I got me, you. Which no. is, yeah. Perfect. Okay. You got me. Or right. I, I got you. I'm okay. backwards. See, I got, I got it backwards just there. I copied. <laughs> yeah. From the tile and not from. Like, yeah. this is the thing. This is yes. the, va this is the value of it. The container. The, yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so what does it want me to do? Imagine each thing in the inbox is an address, and each address refers to a tile zero through nine on the floor. Your task for each address in the inbox, pick up the letter that addresses. So it's teaching me this thing. Yeah. So. Like, yeah. What I want to do is I'm going to grab a thing from the inbox. I'm going to drop it into, let's just drop it into 12, because uh, that's already where the thing is. Then I'm going to copy from the value of 12 and drop that thing in the outbox and then just be done. This is just another tutorial for this thing. Okay. I, I believe that's all we want to see. Because so the, the letters in this one have nothing. There's no... Nope. Just a, yeah, so he's putting it down on 12 days, yep. saying go to 9. Yep. Okay. I, I think that's all we're running on here. Okay. Easy peasy. That's a big thing. Like this, in terms this is, of... Well, this is what also makes it a lot more difficult. Right, right, right. But like that's... Oh, okay. You have variables now. Yeah. You have... You can actually... Oh boy. Oh, a covert assignment. <laughs> I mean, it's fun. Yeah. And like, we're making this quick go longer because it's fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We I could understand. stop. Yes, no, but I, I want to keep going. This is fun. All right, so the other thing I think I have in here, right, is I can label uh, squares now. So you uh, can say. I, so it just makes it hi. easier. Yeah. 
Uh, that's your high square. Yeah. That's where you, that's, that's where you right. get high. Uh, each thing in the inbox is an address of a tile on the floor. For each address, address provided in the inbox, output uh, from the floor, and all following items on the floor until you, you reach, reach a zero. zero. So those are zero, this is zero terminated strings. Yep. Uh, so we're going to grab a thing from the inbox, uh, and we're going to move it to the outbox. Easy. Yeah. Oh, uh, actually, that's not true. If we're using the inbox an address for time, so we're going to copy it to, uh, let's we'll just say that this, That's the one that's open. Yeah, this is our copy. Your copy tile. Copy tile. Can you put there that you wherever go. you want, or is it only that label? In, yeah. I can put it wherever you drag it? Yeah, but okay. you can see now it's, it's just for reference yeah, here. Yeah, it makes totally. it a little easier. So it says copy to copy, uh, and then we're going to copy from copy and put that thing in the outbox. Uh, let's get rid of that so we don't confuse ourselves. Unless when she when she goes or he goes to the inbox, it's at zero. In which case? In which case we're going to go back to the inbox and start over. Is that what I don't saying? think that's right. Is that's that right? On, on all the following items on the floor until you reach a zero. Yeah, and then start over. I believe that's right. Let's. Just, Are we? Let's okay. Just try it. Isn't are you just gonna drop it and pick it up? Oops, sorry. You want to get the oh, floor. You want to get yes. the very like the actual the yeah. address bit, not sorry. the. Like that, yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Uh, what happened? Let's find out what happened. Let's so, go through that slow. Jump in the inbox, copy to copy. Oh, 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 wait. Let's back it up. Let's just see what happens. Each thing in the inbox is an okay, address so on the floor. You put it there, and then he should have gone. And all following items on the floor until you reach a zero. Oh, so you're sorry. Gonna increment yes. it up. Oh, right. Fucking, fucking. God damn it. Okay. So you're going to bump it. So, yes. Yeah. So we're going to go there. We're going to drop four into here. Yes. We're going to grab item four. Then and you're. And then I'm going to bump it up. Uh, well, you're going to. You're going to. I'm going to bump up this. But you're going to bump it after you outbox it, not before. Right. I'm going to bump that up. And then uh, we should be able to run and then this. Sorry. Uh, cool. No, we're going to just jump back to this thing. Uh, up to here. Here. Right, and then if it's a zero, you jump past it, and then yes, yes. No. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, so inbox. If it's well, okay, wait, wait. So wait, no, because I'm gonna bump that thing up, and then if it, it's a zero, then you jump it back. We don't need this. He's not talking about a zero. Yeah, this, he is, is. this is not zero terminated strings in, in the inbox. No, no, but if you hit a zero here, right, that's so what you I need, need to, it to jump be. If it's a zero, uh, when we copy from copy. If that winds up, being I see a what zero, you're saying. Right, go that's here. when you go up to the top. Right, let's yes, just try that. good call. So it's T now. It should be an H. Yep. And then, oh hey, it's a zero. And then boom. Nice, you're good. And that should be a zero. So no. Yep. Uh, so th before there's a let's see, let's see, let's see let's speed it up a little bit. Oh my God. Vinny, what are you telling them to do? I don't read these things. I'm Wait, have working. you not been I'm reading just, these? I'm just working. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't read it. They told you not to read it. Don't be that employee. I, listen. Uh, listen, uh, just do your job. No, I, I National to, security. That's not. You just work in an office. Yeah, sorry. I just work, I just work here. We did it. Have a great year. Austin, you got a bonus. I get a bonus, okay. All right, we're, we're close on here, not so close on here, but you know, with the amount I mean, of... you, yeah, exactly. If you change that size, it will help a lot. You would right. lose, you would lose a lot. I suspect this is gonna go in the reverse. Yeah. Oh, cool, good. Haha, <laughs> oh, seriously. Uh, easy inbox terminate string in the inbox, reverse it and put the result in the outbox. All right, so zero terminate strings just means that when you hit a zero, we're done. Mm -hmm. Let's just try this one really quickly. Uh, copy two here. Uh, for each zero terminate string in the inbox, reverse it. Okay, so let's assume that nothing's going to be longer than 13. I, it better not be. I wish you could see, but welcome to workplaces. Okay, hold on a second. Let me just think for a second. Uh, so we have this. We'll label this zero, right? It'll nice. always be nice. the zero there. Uh, sorry, so we want to put this in here. Uh, so you want to? I just I want to do this efficiently. Mm -hmm. So I want to let's copy that zero. I feel like we're going to need this somewhere else. Are we? Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's just put that there because I feel like I always want a zero somewhere. So we can do a ticker 
So we can copy from, we'll go to the inbox, we'll get this thing. We can put it down here and we can say copy to one, two, three, and four, but that sounds really inefficient. Yeah. Uh, and then reverse it when you hit the zero. That's a lot of lines of code. So we can bump a bump counter. Stuff? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Grab from the inbox. You copy it to... Uh, mm. It's copied it to zero. And then, then repeat it and... Uh, I just... For, hold and on, bump I was, it? I just thinking for a second. Uh, I want to get paper. That's where I'm at right now. <laughs> you want to get a piece of paper? This oh. is, actually, this is, uh, my mind's just skipping on the, like a record track right now. This shouldn't be that hard. Because... Uh, we could easily just kind of keep going back to the inbox, or we should be able to read from this thing, bump it up, and keep putting stuff in the next box. Uh, but I don't think it actually works like that. So we'll do. The, we'll start the slow way. Ready? Mm -hmm. Copy from. I'm sorry, we don't want that. We'll go back to the inbox, mm -hmm. and then we'll copy to. Uh, seems really inefficient. This can't be right. No, that's a really interesting. You can you not bump? What? Tell me. Show me how bump works. What, what's bump? Uh, how does so, we skip that whole segment sorry, of so this bump, game? Sorry, bump basically just goes. Uh, it bumps something on the floor. Yeah, already. he just I picks see. it, but he picks it up. Is the problem? I think he picks it up. Yeah. Okay. Weird. Okay, I see. Um. So he's gonna grab that thing. Yeah. You get rid of that bump. That bump doesn't helping anybody. Uh, he's going to put it down there. And then, I'm sorry, for each zero terminated string in the inbox, reverse it and put the result in the outbox. Like, what I want to do is I want him to grab something and then I want him to put it down in the incremented um, space. Okay, let's do this. Oh, I've, I've got, gonna, I've got I got you. It. Yep. All right, so we're That's gonna, what that zero is there for, because you can bump yeah, that. Yeah, you can bump and it, then... but we just need to put this stuff in a temporary slot to make this. Uh, so we'll just call this temp. Yep. Because uh, he has to pick stuff up. All right. So he, co he goes to the inbox, he copies it to temp, right? And then he... Um, okay. So we've got this. We'll call this count. I might be making this more complicated. I think you're making it more do. complicated. Uh, he goes, he copies it to temp. This is zero right now. He goes and he then copies from, this will say zero. I want to put this thing in the slot that count says. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think you, you want to grab it. So we should be able to put copy, f uh, oh, you know what? I'm sorry, I think you can do this. I, copy two, There's lots of copy. the value of Right, and that. then you bump, Sorry, and I, then you bump the zero. That's what, yeah, 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 exactly. I, I think I was, um, I think I was forgetting that you could read the data from this thing right. without picking it up. Gotcha. Uh, so then you could bump that. And then you bump that. Yeah, and then we just r rinse and repeat. And then we, yeah, we jump that until it's a zero. Because if, if it's a zero. Yeah, until, uh, so we do need to check the inbox when it's a zero. Let me get rid of this stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's. So I don't think we so need So you grab to... a thing from the inbox. Yeah, this is, this is the, the way this is going is yeah. you grab a thing from the Sorry, inbox. Sorry, totally made this more complicated. It's okay. It to be. Uh, grab a thing from the inbox. You copy it to the thing that's in the, the 14 slot, which is zero right now. The, the data number, the data value. Yep. Just copy to a zero. You It'll bump it, it here, so it goes up one. to a one. So you yeah. drop it into there. Uh, and if it's a zero, we're going to go... And if the, but if the thing you're grabbing is a zero... Yep, then we're going to copy from... Uh, we're going to copy from the value of this. Right. And then you're going to move it down, drop, right? Then we're going to drop that in the out box. Right. And then we're going to sub it down. Well, uh, you're going to sub it down? Or you're going to, you just have I'm to sorry, bump, bump it down. Bump minus, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, uh, okay. We're going to bump it down. Uh, and then unless that's zero. Uh, we're, yeah, if okay. If that hits you're zero, right. we're going to start over. Yes. Uh, let's see what happens. Let's see if, the, let's see if we get to this first thing. Bump. <laughs> yeah, it. okay, that's right. Goes in here. So far, so good. Let's speed it up a little bit. And then he should grab the D. Oh, no, it's a zero. Uh, we can't copy. So what happened? So we hit uh, a zero. We jumped from here. Oh, you have that extra jump to zero thing. Wait, no, that Do was you right. you need that? Come from... Oh, because I bump it after I drop this. So it was one plus 
<laughs> wait, what? Wait, wait, yeah, wait. it was. So I think if we move this up here, we should, should be, be fine. Uh, maybe we'll see. It might. It might do one previous now. Yeah, can't jump if zero with empty hands. So it's reading this, but I have nothing in my hands. Mm. Uh, but I also need to jump this thing. All right, so he goes. Right, can't be jump if zero at the if, end there. Yeah, it needs to be when he copies from. Uh -uh. When he bumps it. He, yeah, when he bumps it, right? Ah! Something's, something's goops. Not enough stuff in the outbox. Okay, okay, let's oh, slow I, it down. I didn't repeat my pattern. Uh, I didn't. Oh, all right, you, need to, you need to jump yeah. there. Yeah, there you go. All right, let's try this again. Again, I apologize to anybody watching this who's like, it's clearly obvious. Like what is happening? Oh, that too. See, I'm going the other oh, way. Oh, I think we, we messed this up. Oh, because we kept incrementing. We didn't bump it. Yeah, I'm just going to run through this. I'm going to walk through it for a second. Yeah, sure. This all works. This all works. So far, so good. This all works. All right. Oh, then, yep. Uh, he goes and he's like, I've got a zero. So we're going to jump down here. We're going to uh, bump that down because we only have stuff in the previous spot. Yep. And then he's going to copy from two. He's going to put it in the outbox. Oh, I'm not running this. I'm sorry. So I need to jump. Oh, you need to jump that whole little bit. Yeah, I need to first. jump uh, this bit. That bit. Until... Again, if we're zero, it should jump back up there. Okay, let's try that. Right, because that'll also reset the thing back to zero. Yeah, this is going to be super efficient. Okay. <laughs> I love seeing this work. Oh, I love oh, seeing we this work. It. We missed the letter. Crap. Wait, what, what letter did we miss? Oh, it's because we're... I think it's because we're counted in the wrong sequence. Because basically what happened... Go through it again real quick? Yeah, this is a good one because it's a short one. Yeah. Uh, you go to the... Uh, yep, uh-huh. You can also play this until you want to stop it. I'm just kind of clicking through it. All right, so then we do our thing here. It's like a zero, I'm going to bump it down. Yep. I'm going to do this. One, I'm going to bump it down, I'm going to do this. And then he clicks that, and he needs to get the zero space. Oh, <laughs> and he can't. He can't because he's saying it's a zero. Yeah. So here's what I'm going to do. Ready? I'm, gonna, I'm just going to say <sighs> fuck this whole thing, and uh -huh. we're going to do this. Um, we're going to go up here, and we're going to say... At the very beginning, we're just going to bump that. Oh, sure. Because it'll never be a zero. And it'll just start at one, right? Yeah, it should. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, because it's, oh, it's no, bumping wait. every time. Oh, wait, no. It's we, bumping yeah, each sorry. time. We need to, we need to, that's the first thing we need to yes. do. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> this is nonsense. People watching at home, I'm so sure this is nonsense, but it's rad. I promise yeah, it's, it's rad. Uh-oh, no. It went... Did we forget a letter? We must have. Wait. Or like... Maybe it's fine. That's not wrong. Bad we, we made it pretty. We made it pretty far. We made it to the very end. Uh, I'm gonna step through that again. What happened there? I wish you could step through the exact one you just did. Uh, you can rewind it. Oh, Sorry. Yeah. okay. So I That's keep, okay. That's yeah. okay. Okay. Let's just. Walk okay, so then this. here, this is this is what happened, right? So he gets a zero. Oh, the he. You're bumping it down. That's fine. That's yeah. right. And he should go to four. Yep. It should go to... Then you should go to two, uh-huh. One. And then, and then where does this go? go? Oh, then he bumps it down to a zero. Yeah, but he should then jump back up here because it's zero. Right, remember we didn't want to use that zero slot for some reason. Well, we're not using it because, uh, but that should be... F that should be fine, oh, see what I, I mean? See. He's actually... Oh, right, so this jump, if it's zero, it needs to start oh, all so, the way so over. Oh, yeah, so there you go. Yeah, yeah, that first bump is okay to repeat yeah. at the very yeah, end yeah. of the... Oh, let's see if this is, does it. I bet you can do this in like two steps. No, I bet this is... I bet you're right that this is not as efficient as it could be. This looks good. It's awesome when it runs fast like this. Yeah. Yeah, we did it! I'm like not sure we did... Okay, we did it. Boom! Oh, man! That's it. That was the solution. We came in under par. Yeah. Cheers. I don't know how. That's great. I don't. I don't uh, know that we can. But do I think it. we'll stop there. Yeah, that was a big one. Uh, so, like I said, I did, the, and I've done that already, mm -hmm. and I don't remember a damn mm -hmm. thing. All I could say is, I got up to here, and said, "Fuck it." <laughs> All right, that one you have to say uh, if there's a duplicate. 
Uh, and so it gives you a board. Right? Oh, a duplicate string? No, a oh, duplicate okay. letter. So it gives you a board. It gives you the inbox. Uh huh. And then it says uh, you can put one of them away, but if you hit a duplicate then uh, erase all the duplicates and don't put any more in there. So if you oh, get a D, boy. put the first D in the out box, but if you get a duplicate, never put a D in there. Now remember, never you, put a D. you can't just directly compare letters. Right. You can subtract the numerical value of a letter. Uh -huh. So you can say if I have an A and I subtract an A from an A, it'll equal zero. So that's right. how you can check for that's a duplicate. Algebra. But then you have to have a ticker going to be like, Okay, well, I've hit one of these A's yes. so far, but then you need to do that for every letter that it might possibly throw to. And you don't have infinite tiles. And you, and you don't have infinite tiles, and you don't know how many they're going to give you. And that's a situation where you it's could theoretically hit us, unless that's a, is that a set board, or is that an inbox outbox thing still? That's still, there's still inbox of stuff coming in. Yeah. That's changed every time. Yeah. That's one of those things, that, this is the thing that's it's kind of interesting about this that reminds me again a lot of actual programming is, like that one we almost succeeded at just now, Yeah. right? Uh, there was a real problem with it that we fixed, but sometimes you get a thing where it's like, oh, there's not a problem here, like this is just working, and then it isn't working, you just happen to stumble into the one sequence of events where it's, where you think you've solved it, yeah. because it's solved for this one set of things. So that happens a lot. Yeah. So they usually throw, it'll be random, but not completely random, because uh -huh. they'll throw in the thing that's gonna break, they'll throw in the zero, right? right. right. That's like, yeah, I know, your thing's gonna break because it, it works on positive numbers, right. and I'm always gonna throw in a zero here. And then he'll say in the text, he'll be like, yeah, it kinda worked until I threw nice. in this other thing. Uh, I'm, glad that that's, I'm glad that it's smart enough to, to do that. Yeah, and, and this stuff is, I, I think it's awesome and it's a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. uh, and these side ones uh, I think are great too, because they kinda just make you do a, a little more um, advanced stuff okay. that is like, uh, but I thought the duplication one was like, I might not be thinking about it the right way, but yeah. man. But it's rough. Uh, I spent about, I called my wife down to be like, can you help me with this? Is she a math person? Uh, more than I am. Okay. Uh, so, I don't know. I, you know, it's logic and math and you yeah. know, algebra and all that yeah. stuff. But this is- Really nice package here. Yeah, really cool. And it's a uh, $10 mm -hmm. human resource machine. Like I said, I think this is something that looks like it is probably designed to go right to touch mm -hmm. screen. Uh, there's a Wii U and tablet uh, version on the, on the way. Stated that it'll be on the way on yeah. the website. But uh, human resource machine. And Thanks. again, I want to shout out uh, Little Inferno, their previous game, which is often on sale, super cheap, and it's completely different. No programming in that game. Yeah. You just like the style of this game, like oh man, look at these cute characters, and it's vaguely dark. Check that out. But I want to play this. This is cool. Thanks, Austin. Thanks, Winnie.